people had to escape when a fire broke out in a Concord, New Hampshire home this morning. One of the residents jumped from the building. WBZ's Nicole Jacobs is live in Concord this noon with the story. Nicole? Kate, much of the fire was contained to the kitchen where it began. The woman inside that apartment did jump from the second floor window. The chief says she landed on the roof of that doorway before rolling onto the sidewalk. I, I just saw a lot of uh, thick smoke. At the corner of South State and Downing Streets in Concord, an early morning fire sparked chaos. And on fire alarm, jumped from the second floor window. She was one of five people inside the multifamily home at the time, 620, according to fire officials. She landed on the roof of this doorway and rolled off. She was alert, she was conscious, uh, she was hurt. I can tell that she was in pain. Warren Haslin heard the alarms and knock at his door. I hear a knock on the door, which was my next door neighbor. She was knocking on it as she ran down the stairs. The fire chief says it began as a kitchen fire and was quickly knocked down. Yeah, they had heavy fire pushing out of the second floor window, so there was actual fire. And uh, you can even tell from the street that we had a pretty significant amount of fire, but there was actual fire venting out of the windows. And while all residents made it out, several animals are unaccounted for. Friends of the woman who jumped tell us off camera she had two therapy cats. The American Red Cross is assisting the five residents who, for now, are displaced. Warren Haslin is one of them. I've been trained to stay calm in difficult situations. He credits his time in the Army for that. He'll stay in a hotel until the smoke clears and fire officials determine how it started. The fire chief says it is unclear if the resident was actually cooking in the kitchen. He says that is all still part of the investigation. But he says he's so grateful that everyone was able to make it out and that woman who jumped is going to be okay. That's the very latest from Concord, New Hampshire. Nicole Jacobs, WBZ News.